Right, let's progress onwards. Turns out they weren't they weren't going to challenge me to a battle. Turns out they were going to introduce me to a new town. And I was a fool for thinking otherwise. It's probably not that at all. But whatever. It's probably a battle. Hello there. Have you ever heard of a Pokemon called Flababy? <laughs> Flabebe? I don't know. So you haven't seen one yet? Well, that's something you can look forward to. Baby is now, brace yourself, a fairy type Pokemon. Fairy type is in your, oh my god. This turned the entire time matchup system on its head. <laughs> this is pretty much like, this is, <laughs> this is like a tamer version of what all the hardcore Pokemon fans were like. Just like, what are you doing? This is making things, ice types are now useless. Ah! <laughs> We've been battling fairy type Pokemon against the other types of Pokemon at Professor Sycamore's request. My name's Cena. It's a beautiful name for a beautiful lady. You have a big ego. I'm Dexio. Two years ago, Professor Sycamore entrusted me with a Pokedex. You could call me a Pokemon Voyage veteran. If you'd like, I'll show you the way to the lab. So come along now. Okay, sure. Let's get to Shaun the Rose. Should have seen it. I, I called it after I went to the Pokemon Center. I was just like, yeah. It's not gonna be. It's gonna be taking me to the lab. Yeah, he is. <laughs> so, how are you and Briggs and getting along? Oh, we're doing fine. The more you walk around with your Pokemon, the stronger your friendship will become. Oh, team for return. Cool. All right, thanks. That's nice. Thank you very much. Right through this gate, and you'll be in Lumo Lumio City. Go on already. All right, just want to talk to you. You look like someone from Timby. <laughs> Lumio's, uh, Lumio's, I can't actually say that. Lumio City is the biggest city in all of Kalos. There's still plenty I haven't seen. Oh, this is the big, big city. Okay. Right, okay. The City of Light. Ah. Okay. How big is this thing? Is this the place with the Eiffel Tower? Yeah, it is. I thought it would be. Yeah, it's quite big. I can see that. <laughs> oh, wow. I can actually... Oh, wow. It's stunning looking. Wow. I'll go ahead and wait in front of the lab for you. Follow her that way to the lab. Wow, this is stunning. Ah, oh, so that's the lab. This is just amazing. Wow. South Boulevard. This place is sure is... Wow! Oh my god, that car looks like it has a face. Look at it. It's clearly two eyes and a mouth. I mean, seriously. Wait, so I can can I travel in the taxi? I say, however, you know how the power's out in the north half of town, right? It just ain't wise to drive around in such a confusion. Ah, oh, okay, fair enough. Well, that's that's fair. Yeah, I'm fine. I'll go there now. Jeez, all right. Hey there. <laughs> This is so cool. I think this is where we're going to gain our second starter. This building is the Sycamore Pokemon Lab. Let's go inside. Alright, let's. You travelled a long way from Va Vanneville Town, but you're finally here. The professor can't wait to meet you. You can find him on the third floor. So hop in the elevator. This is a big lab. <laughs> Normally it's quite small. Professor has taught many people about Pokemon. I'm, I'm sure he has. Welcome to the Sycamore Pokemon Laboratory. Professor Sycamore researches Pokemon evolution. Okie dokie. Cool. Alright, which floor should we go to? Let's go to two first. See what's happening to. Oh, this might actually uh, be where the fossil stuff is in this game. It's a charm. There's quite a possibility, actually. To become good friends with Pokemon, it's, it's, the, it's best to be with them all the time. Please use these. Oh, Luxury Balls. Cool. Oh, nice. A Pokemon caught with a Luxury Ball will become friendly more easily. The professor is researching evolution and change. I heard that he learned a lot from Professor Rowan and Sinnoh when he was young. Ah, okay. There are male Pokemon, female Pokemon, and even Pokemon with unknown genders. Some Pokemon have a different appearance depending on gender. Each Pokemon has a mysterious power called an ability. Some abilities have effects during a battle, and some have effects in the field. 
I heard for the TV and the washing machine are necessary for research on certain Pokemon. Ah, Rotom. Ooh, fighting completely in sync with my favourite Pokemon gives me the chills. Oh my god, the Pokeballs are floating! <laughs> I'm developing a tool that will help my research. It's pretty difficult work. Please wait patiently for it to be completed. Well, that's Garbodor. I have absolutely no idea what he's doing. But I am intrigued. <laughs> ah, let's go for 3F. Hello. So we finally meet. I like his theme. Fantastic, you're here. Come this way, won't you? Sure. What do you have to say? The number of Pokemon you've encountered in Central Callus Pokedex is 28. I'll give you this item so you can befriend even more Pokemon. Okay. Thanks. Oh, yes, of course. Oh, yeah, that is handy. I forgot about that. Yes. That's pretty cool. Many thanks for coming all the way to Vanneville Town. From Vanneville. I'm Professor Sycamore. It's a pleasure to finally meet you. How is your Pokemon journey going so far? Have you met many different Pokemon? Fantastic! Let me take and have a quick look at your Pokedex and see. Hmm, so you've seen 28 kinds of Pokemon in Central Callus then. Ho ho! The pages are getting filled in. It's starting to look good. Well now, you do have a certain Genesis choir words. I have a good feeling about you. At first, I was thinking of choosing only one child from a town when I was deciding who to give a Pokemon to. In Vanderville Town, it was going to be the child of a veteran trainer I know. About then, I learned that the Rhyhorn Racer Grace and her son were moving here. Here in, in the Kalos region, you're far away from everything you used to know. But it really hit me right here. Then it hit me. I should give you a Pokemon and, and have you travel around Kalos. Hi, Professor, it's John. Oh, cool. John's here. So do to have kept you waiting. Fantastic. Now let's all have a Pokemon battle. Your opponent shall be me. Oh, okay. Uh, Pokemon battle in lab? Huh? Sounds good. Let's go start. Fine. Shall we start the battle? Bring it. Just so you know, I'm not that tough. Oh, come on, man. It should be a cakewalk. You have all three... Canto starters. Oh dear. What level? Please not high. Please not high. Please not. To Actually, no, please 10, because I get a level 10. Yes, I get a level 10! Yes, I get a level 10! I'm getting a level 10 Squirtle! Yes! This is a good thing. That was quick. Good. Aww. I get a level 10 Squirtle! Yes! Awesome. I am fully on board with this. Squirtle! Uh, let's switch out to uh, Spupa. Uh, yeah, why not Spupa? Go for it. Oh, just to be, just to be safe. Don't want to accidentally ruin life. Bye. Having Squirtle obliterate me. That would be a bad idea. See, that's like a whoa, that looks cool in this game. And quite deadly. It was mainly because it was critical. But yeah, this is doing nothing. Stun sport. Not taking any chances. Squirtle is so adorable. Water gun is apparently very powerful, so I'm going to enjoy Squirtle. I may be able to get some cool Charizard upgrades with Mega Evolutions, but. You know. Blastoise looks like a Dalek, and nothing really beats that. When it comes down to it, it's important that you're a Dalek, because it's badass. You can't deny it does look like a Dalek, though. <laughs> I don't think anyone can deny that. <laughs> I think it's safe to say, wouldn't you agree? <laughs> the, the, the dome of, of Blastoise does look... Quite, the, the cannon looks a lot more like a Dalek now. It's kind of cool. Well, you finished me. Congrats. You tried, Spupa. You tried. 
I'll let Fennekin finish it. Oh no, it's not Fennekin, it's Gregson. Oh, that's gonna take a while. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna call Fennekin that. I'm gonna. I'm gonna call Gregson Fennekin a few times, I'm sure. As I already have. This might kill you. Yes, brilliant. Well done, Gregson. I'm proud of you. Charmander. Oh, you're so adorable! Okay. Scratch that thing. I wonder if um, there are shiny Mega Evolutions. Wait. Ah, accuracy. Okay. Ah, oh, damn you! Ember. Saw that coming. Didn't do much there. Didn't think it would, in all fairness. Just one more. That's all I need. God damn it! <laughs> you're an annoying Charmander, you know that. There we go, you're done. Yeah, I was gonna say, I think you're done at least. At least I'm almost positive you are. <laughs> you're too much for me. You're really something, aren't you? Yeah, I am. That's a lot of money, cool. This music reminds me of something from Professor Layton. I think I've about figured it out. Figured what out? Till you are an interesting Pokemon trainer indeed. It'd be fantastic if you took another Pokemon with you. Here, pick one. Yes, it's mine! It's gonna be mine! It's gonna be Squirtle! Give me Squirtle! The fire type Charmander. The grass type Bulbasaur. Good, it looks like it has a huge head from that angle. But Squirtle! I want Squirtle! Squirtle, Squirtle! Give me Squirtle! You picked Squirtle then. I see, that's simply wonderful. Yes, yeah, Squirtle! I'm so happy. Would you like to give your Pokemon a nickname? Nah, I'm fine, thank you. Oh, I see, you're not going to give your Pokemon a nickname then. Since you chose Squirtle, I'll give you this Mega. <gasps> Blastoise and Knight. Daleks coming! Yeah, okay. <laughs> Come now, you two pick your Pokemon. I don't know which one to pick, it's so difficult. You'll be together for a long time, so just take your time. Well, I've got a feeling everyone else will show up soon. Uh, you're too late, you don't get Pokemon. <laughs> Hi, Professor Sycamore. What's this? Everyone is already here? See? Wonderful, everyone's all here. So now that we're all here, I'd like to say a few words. Be the best trainer you can be. At the same time, remember to have fun traveling with your Pokemon. Also, I want to ask for your help in solving the, the Kalos region's biggest Pokemon mystery. Kalos region's biggest uh, the secrets and potential of Mega Evolution, a new kind of evolution that occurs in battle. That's why I gave you the Mega Stone just now. It's an important clue. Mega Evolution? What should we do about the Pokedex? Trevor, my lad, if that's what best trainer means to you, then I want you to go out there and complete that Pokedex. Mega Evolution sounds really interesting. If you're investigating Mega Evolution, why don't you check out Cam Free at Friar Freer Town? That town has a lot of history. You might find a hint there. Now listen, if you visit many different places to complete the Pokédex, you will probably see Pokémon with many ways of living, ways of living, and meet people with many ways of thinking. First, accept the ways of living and thinking that sometimes conflict with your own, and think about what's tr really important. This will truly broaden your horizons. I feel that being different from others makes me special. Mastering Mega Evolution will definitely set me apart from the trainers. I will master all of them. Now listen. Alright. Thank you. Bye guys. <laughs> Seriously, what do the two guys have as Pokemon? They, like, there's... I, they didn't pick a starter. It looks like they're too late to the party with these. So what Pokemon do they have? I want to know. Turns out they have legendaries. Oh, who are you? You have nice hair. You have... You have a Wolverine here. So I'll be able to meet them soon then? Yes. The children chosen by, by the professor. I wonder what potential they have. And here's one of them now. That's Teal. Teal, come here a sec. Oh, you received a Pokedex from the professor then? How wonderful. That is a wonderful thing indeed. You are one of the chosen ones. I am Lin Sandre. I've tried to learn as much about Pokemon as I can to help build a brighter future. Professor Sycamore has taught me so much. Oh, I see you have a holocaster. Knowledge is power, after all. Put it to good use. 
Now listen, it is vital that this world become a better place. And the people and Pokemon chosen to make the world better must work tirelessly to achieve this goal. Well, I'll be off. Please give Professor Sycamore my best. My desire is it. My desire. It is for a more beautiful world. Still, I wonder what kind of beautiful world Lissandra desires. In this great big Kalos region, there are many different Pokemon. I hope getting a Pokedex gives you a chance to learn about them. I can't... The, uh, the evil team in this game is Team Flare, right? I wonder if he's the leader, or at least someone from it, because he seems to want to make the world beautiful, and I believe that Team Flare are fashionistas, I think. There's a place I want to go check out, so I'll see you around. Alright. There's something I want to talk, talk to you about. I went for you in Café Soleil, neighbour. Okay. Oh, I wonder what Serena wants to talk about. Why couldn't she just use the Holocaster? No clue, but it seems hush-hush. I am curious about what's going on, but we should probably stay out of it. Hey, Teal. To get to Camfria Town, leave the lab and turn left and go straight. That cafe Salil Selena was talking about is over that way too. Okay, thank you very much. I guess we'll go there now. I was thinking about going to a gym, but... Oh! Look at that! Lumio City is m maybe very large, but if you stay on the main streets, it, um, you shouldn't get lost. I'm gonna go on a little walk. The streets sure wind and wander here. Oh, just so you know, Camphrey Town and Cafe. Yeah, yeah, okay. That's great. Cool. I'm sorry, but I'm too stunned by the giant that over there. Look at that. Stunning. So, oh, look at that, Pikachu and <gasps> Go Goat! It's Go Goat! I need Go Goat! So that's the way out. Okay. Like, there's so much to explore here, I actually don't even know where to begin. Is this the cafe? It's possible. Well, I've gone in now. It looks like a cafe. It's not the cafe I'm looking for. Uh, long. Yeah, you'd really do. Oh, alright. <laughs> okay, so who am I? Where were they? <laughs> I don't know. It wouldn't let me move for a second, that was weird. Wow, stunning. <gasps> Look at it, Skiddo! I need Skiddo. I need it. I need it. Oh, right, okay, it's blackout, sure. So where do I go? Said about a cafe. Maybe it's in the middle. It's a possibility. It's at the Eiffel Tower itself. Oh, never mind. No, maybe not. Oh, it's here. Duh. Completely missed it. Could you come here for a second? I don't know how I completely missed it, but I did because I'm stupid. Oh, it's Linsandri. And is that dear Diantha? Just so you know, neighbor, Lissandra is head of the Lissandra Labs, which created the Holocaster, a video messaging device. You already know who Diantha is, right? She's one of the most famous movie stars in the world, after all. Yeah, it's Team Flair, definitely. I wonder what the two of them are doing here together. You played a young girl so wonderfully in your debut on the silver screen. Wouldn't you rather remain young and beautiful forever and always play such roles? What a strange question. Why would I want to play the same old roles forever? You've made me beautiful, but it's not all there is to life. Everything changes. I want to live and change like that too. So I look forward to playing different roles as I get older. You were chosen to be a movie star, correct? Isn't it your duty to be ever beautiful? Everything beautiful should stay that way forever. I would end the world in an instant so that beauty never fades. I can't stand the thought of the world becoming uglier. Oh, hello, Teal. This is Diantha, one of the most accomplished movie stars in Kalos. She moves the multitudes with her excellent acting. Which is to say, she dedicates her life to making other people happy. Oh, if only everyone were like her. What a beautiful world this would be. If you'll excuse me. I've got some evil to perform. And who are you two? 
My name is Serena and this is Teal, right? I heard Linsandre call you that. You both have lovely names. Oh, and you're both trainers. Don't your Pokemon look happy? I'm a trainer myself in my off time. I look forward to us battling someday. Oh, cool. She's probably going to be an optional boss. Awesome. Hmm. I guess if you're a Pokemon trainer, you battle everyone no matter who they are. Oh, that's right. I have something to ask you, neighbor. Just call me Teal. Would you be willing to compete with me to see which one of us will become stronger? I know we set off on our journey just after you arrived for Vanilleville, but we are neighbours and I think it would be fun to have a competition with you. Just so you know, I won't lose though. Is that a challenge now? Hmm. Guess if you're a Pokemon trainer, you battle everyone no matter who they are. Oh, it's not now then. Alright. If you're like a cheerful son, everyone will be grateful. If you're like the Pokemon Sorok, well, some things are best left unsaid. <laughs> what? Edlin Tundra is gathering young people here for society's, for society's sake. The only thing that's important about espresso is whether it's delicious or not. Yes. I drink two cups of coffee a day. The type of cake doesn't really matter. You know what? This cafe is the movie star Diantha's favourite. I come here every day hoping to admire Diantha. Okay. I want to see Diantha's, Diantha's movie. The one where she, she travels with Pokemon. That's cool. I'm going to sit down, then I'm going to stand up, and I'm going to walk away. Um, I think, because we have done a lot, uh, or I have recorded a lot, um, so yeah, let's start editing this, I guess, and uh, rendering it and whatnot, and yeah, I'm just going to meet up at the start here, so I don't get lost, and because I will, let's face it, I will probably get lost very easily. Ah, that's the uh, battling thing. Okay. So, yeah, let's save. Because saving is good. But, yeah, I've been playing it for... Wow, that saved fast! Did that actually save? Wow! That's... That... that... <laughs> so, I know it sounds stupid, but that actually is one of the most impressive things about this game. Because Pokemon games normally take, like, 20 seconds to save. That's insane! That, that really caught me off guard. <laughs> oh man, that's actually really impressive. But um, anyway, okay. <laughs> I know that's something I shouldn't be impressed about, but it's pretty cool. Uh, so yeah, that, I hope you've enjoyed what I've done so far, and I will see you next time. See you then.